Two brothers, a dream of flight, and a machine that would change history. Wilbur and Orville Wright weren't scientists. They weren't wealthy. They were bicycle mechanics from Dayton, Ohio. But what they lacked in resources, they made up for with relentless determination. Their journey began with gliders. Long hours of testing on the windswept shores of Kitty Hawk, North Carolina. They studied birds, designed their own engine, and created something revolutionary, wing warping. A breakthrough that allowed them to control an aircraft in flight. Then came the moment. December 17, 1903. Orville climbed into the Wright Flyer. The engine sputtered. The propellers spun. And then it lifted off. 12 seconds. 120 feet. The first powered, controlled flight in human history. Later that day, Wilbur flew even farther. 852 feet in 59 seconds. Mankind had conquered the sky. At first, few believed them. The idea of human flight seemed impossible. But by 1905, their planes could fly for nearly 40 minutes. By 1909, they were selling aircraft to the U.S. military. The world would never be the same. Two brothers, a simple workshop, and a vision that defied the impossible. The Wright brothers didn't just build a machine. They gave humanity wings.